Flashlights. Flashlights were common in the trenches. Army issued flashlights were made to fit into a cartridge belt and functioned with batteries. Broken German Bayonet This long, broad, flat German bayonet was designed to thrust into an enemy's ribcage and break his ribs. Armoured vehicles. Assault artillery was invented during the war in an attempt to break through enemy lines. The first prototypes of armoured vehicle appeared. Generals noted that vehicles fitted with wheels were ineffective in a trench environment. Engineers thus worked on prototypes to overcome the problem and caterpillar tracks proved to be the perfect solution to the problem. No Man's Land No Man's Land was the zone located between the Allied and enemy trenches. The distance varied between 50 and 1,500 yards. The zone was watched closely by day and anyone venturing out would be shot, but by night it became a theatre of espionage, when barbed wire and traps were set to protect the trenches. Most battle casualties resulted in this zone. Dead rat. A dead rat wasn't garbage, especially a dead rat on a skewer which would be spit roasted for dinner. You can't reason with a starving man. German coins. The German currency, the mark, underwent rapid devaluation during the war to help the German Empire provide for the war effort. German soldiers were as poorly paid as their allied enemies, and earned just under 16 marks a month, or 15 pounds, 84 US dollars, in today's currency.
given a hero's welcome by the French forces. Emile wrote to Anna to let her know that her father was free and out of harm's way. Freddy and Emile's reunion, however, would be short-lived.